everyone. I'm Becky and I'm here with my daughter MJ Hello. and it is time for another Facebook Science Live brought to you on behalf of the Children's Museum. So today we're coming to you from our new Facebook Live Science Studio that we made in our house. We're pretty excited about that. Uh, we want to thank everybody who's been joining in with us the past mm -hmm. week. It's been really exciting to see you guys following along with us and all the things that you guys have been creating. It's been super exciting. So if you're, uh, for today, we are going to do a milk color changing experiment. It's really cool. It is really cool. Uh, so the ingredients you're gonna need, we'll run through them, people can go grab what they need, and then we'll get started. We need dish soap, you will need milk, and- Of course we have a cow, since yeah, it's milk. Yeah, we decided to use my grandmother's milk cow pitcher, because <laughs> it's really fun. Uh, you will need a pie plate or an shallow dish of some sort, Q-tips, food coloring, and then we have a little dish where we're going to put our uh, dish soap. Couldn't think of the right word there. So, and we have Spike. Some of you have, have commented on Spike. He's become our mascot. We decided he's going to join us for all of our Facebook lives and all the science things we do. I still so, like the cow. Yeah, I know you really like the cow. He's like kind of cow. fun. I like cows. All right, so I think we are ready to go ahead and get started. If you're just jumping in, we will do this a couple of times so everybody gets a chance to see what we're doing. And um, just in case you just came in, um, the ingredients you'll need is milk, and we have a cow since it's milk. Um, we need one of these Q-tips. <laughs> Q-tips, yes. A, a pie plate or shallow dish. Um, a dish show, dish, dish soap. Yep. Sorry. Food coloring, and we have a little dish um, to put the dish soap in because you. Yep. We'll explain later. We'll explain later. All right, so let's get started. We're going to add the milk to the pie plate, and you need about a quarter inch. It doesn't take a whole lot. Now, I will mm -hmm. say we are using 2% milk. It's important that you have a little bit of milk fat yeah, in your milk. Yeah, we're using 2% yeah, milk. Yeah, we're using 2%. I thought we were doing something. Yeah, that's okay. So um, this experiment works because you need a little bit of that milk fat. So I'll put this in the fridge. Okay. So what um, MJ is going to do? She's going to add a little bit of the dish soap to our bowl. This just makes it easier to do the experiment. That looks good. Okay. Don't need a whole lot. I like the color. I know we got, we got fun colors. So now we're going to take our food coloring, and we are just going to put dots. Just random things, and I'm going to. So we did that. I'm gonna add a little first. Just gonna add a little green. And well, so what's happening well, right now well, well, is yeah. since yeah. milk is a combination of water and the milk fat, and because food coloring is just mostly water, right now the food coloring is just sitting right on top in its place. And notice we haven't stirred it, so that's really important. Then now, what, then what you do is you're going to dip the like when we dip this in, of course it gets the dish soap on it, and so it basically just goes apart like that. See? So what MJ just did is we just dipped the Q-tip into the soap, and we just put a little dot right in the middle of. You wanna you wanna like put it. Yeah. It, it, sometimes it helps to just like put it like all the way down, but it doesn't always work. So we, um, and you can do this a couple of times with the same yeah. bowl of milk. I just so, want, so yeah. I'm so we're gonna let this sit for a moment. Where should I put this? Um, just on the table. Uh, okay. There I, we go. I don't, don't want to get it. It's okay. Again. We'll clean the table. So what's going on is, it's like I mentioned, that milk is a combination of water and milk fat, and the food coloring, because it's mostly water, just sits on top. So when we add the soap, because soap breaks apart fat molecules. What happens when you add the soap, it starts racing to all the fat molecules, and when it does, it drags the food coloring with it. And kind so, of, kind of like what happens when, um, with a vacuum cleaner or when you sweep, you sweep the dust out, and at the same time, you're also sweeping up other things in my like bottle caps. Yes, yeah, so, yeah, so you take, I had to think of something. Yeah, so it takes everything with it. Mm -hmm. It's also like when you wash your hands or you do your dishes and they have some grease on them, the soap picks up, it breaks apart the grease and, and washes it off the dishes. So, with the soap and the water. Exactly. 
So what's kind of fun is you can let this sit for a little bit and you can see the milk go and the so we'll see the food coloring go. It's pretty fun. And a good scientist, as everyone knows, almost everyone I think, knows what you, you if you're a good scientist, you need to do your experiment more than once. Do we um, so our, uh, yep, so that? I'm so we're gonna do this again. Do we're gonna need the more? other we're gonna need way. the other picture. Okay. So we're gonna set this uh, out of the way. And MJ just brought us another pan. And then we need some more milk over here. It's quite cold. Yeah, it's okay. Just got the fridge. So oh, for those of you okay. that are just joining us or have gotten your materials, we're gonna show this again. So this is our color changing milk. So I'm gonna add the milk to the pan again. And again, you just need about a quarter inch, just sort of cover it so you don't need a whole lot. Okay, and then we add the food coloring. Yep, so we're gonna add a couple drops Beep, of food bang, coloring. Bang, 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 bang. You're providing us some science music. Yes. Yes, all right, good music always makes things better. All right. All right, so like, now. I just like being red, so. Um, so now we have the milk in, or the food coloring on top of the milk, and make sure you don't stir it. And now we're going to dip yep. our Q-tips in the um, so. dish soap. Yep. And when you do that, you get a dish soap on the Q-tip. And so you, then you just dip it in it and voila. Well, is it voila or voila? It's voila. Oh. <laughs> New word. So. New word. So what's happening again, you can see, is that Fun. as we add the soap, it breaks apart those fat well, molecules no, no, no. and it spreads the food coloring all the way through the milk. And it's kind of fun to sit here and watch it. This the soap continues to move through the milk. Mm -hmm. It's just really uh, fun to watch it. So um, as a lot of you have learned, we have some really great activities coming to you all week long. Uh, I'm excited go, for the next one. Yeah, Mary, um, MJ has something super excited planned for our next one. That was her choice, so stay tuned. But if you go to the this. yes, so if you go to the museum's website, childrensmuseum.org/museumathome, or follow us on Facebook or other social channels, you will get notification of all the cool things that we're doing, bringing fun stuff to your home while we are all hunkered down and learning new things. And once again, please share your experiments. It's been super fun to see what everybody's been doing. And we will see you next time. Science Hall! Science Hall!